Hello and good morning. If this is your first time joining us on Slick Landscapes, and if you like what you see, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and share with all your friends. Happy Thanksgiving once again. Today we have ourselves a normal 16 by 20 canvas. You can find these really cheap at Hobby Lobby. My colors include yellow ochre, Indian yellow, titanium white, sap green, phthalo blue, red ochre, burnt umber, and Mars black. All right. Let me tell you what I got on the canvas right here. It's already got a look, very thin, thin, thin coat of liquid white, so that way when we start painting, our colors are just going to fly right off and get on there. Tell you what I'm going to do. Let's get in there, get started with a little bit of the Indian yellow. Tap that, tap that in. Tap that in. And then we're going to start in the corners and work our way in. Reason being, white. The less color and so it's going to look darker around and then kind of get move and disappear together and that's kind of what we're looking for just to get a nice little morning glow going that's kind of all we're looking for right now and we're just going to keep bringing it down Little crisscross strokes, trying to blend that black and in that yellow and that white together. Set that down right quick. I don't have a. I'm just come in here and just blend everything together. Now you can come back in here and start again with some more yellow and mark yourself down. In fact, you know what? Just so that way we got a little bit more color right there. Let me get rid of this little thing that put up on my thing. Okay. Let's go ahead and add some more color in here. Go back to the Indian yellow. Start in that same corner. I'll just kind of wind up. Killing that we're going for lighter colors. Bring it down as far as you want. You're not gonna have a whole lot in here today. Alright. Tell you what, let's go ahead and go with that same dirty brush. Let's go in here with a little bit of the white. A little bit of the yellow, I mean in black. Yellow and black. And that white mixture. Kind of getting kind of a purplish color right here. And now, go in here, just add some little circles using the corner of the brush. And ourselves some clouds. Wherever you feel a cloud needs to go. Clean dry brush. Come in here, tap on the bases. Lift up to fluff these clouds up. Kind of go in in a swoop down motion, lift them up very gently. Kind of just blend them in. Okay. Go ahead and clean this brush. All over this paint thinner. About a little bit of water, not much. Come in here, grab a little bit of this blue, a little bit of the phthalo blue, and then how about some? Start on the edge and drag it in. And then just 
gently blend it all in. A little bit of a foreground for going up there, and I don't want to do anything major. I think what we're going to do today, we're going to try to go for kind of a kind of a purple color. So we're going to take some of this phthalo blue or this red ochre. Drag it in through this brush. Just pull down. Really, a lot of strength. Then we're going to come in here. Think where your setting's going to go. Bring down. Just kind of down as you're going. Make some of them bigger than the others. Okay. Kind of looks like just a random blob. Right. I'm coming here with a little circular like brush. We're just gonna lift up, go in various directions. Make it look like these we got tons of trees and stuff. They're just growing in crazy little ways. Because every tree's different. It's never going to grow the same way as the other, uh, as its neighbor. Back with that brush that we started off with. Tap the bottom edges. If you want to create a layer here. Another brush. A little bit closer. Come in here with some of the yellow ochre. A little bit of titanium white. And I am completely losing my mind where I'm going with this. We'll just take our knife. Get rid of that. A little bit of titanium white from the black. We're gonna make ourselves a grayish color. And here. in between here. You know what? And since we got ourselves kind of a weird happy little action right there, take this brush that we used to make them to begin with. Let's just kind of circle it up. I'm not really liking what I'm seeing here. And then we'll just fluff it up. There, we got ourselves a very dark cloud coming in from the horizon. There we go. Big storm cloud moving in. Okay. A little bit more black to our gray, darken it up a little bit. And we got ourselves kind of a layer coming through here. One more little layer. Okay. 
want to. I'm going to lift this up. It look like I don't know, little trees are in here. Now, that's kind of fun. Come in here with a clean pan brush. Lift up. It looks like you got the guns. All things going on there. All right. Now let's come in here. Favorite thing for this technique. And down, I'm going to create little and blend them in. Well, let's see here. Give ourselves a little common arrow. We can just Here, so I think I'm just going to take a little bit of the brown, just come in here with this little knife and just literally just spin it in there and just use the knife to take what you want, let the canvas take what you want off the knife. Grab a little bit of our move in here. Catch it in there. Apparently, I wasn't ready to. Okay. All right. Well, I'm going to put some of this yellow ochre and this burnt umber. I'm going to try to go for some, a little bit of this black. We're going to try to go for a very dark earthy tone here. Drop in the land mass. Take ourselves medium white, burnt umber, over here we're going to Got some grounds that poke out over here. He's got a little friend. Right here, and get big. All 
Another night. Come in here. Easily do their fan brush. They don't have a clean fan brush over here, so we'll come over here. Grab some liquid wipe. Well, that brush is dry. Grab our summer blue liquid wipe. Grab some of the yellow ochre. Tap green. Hold that brush, and now we're just come in here and drop in some leaves. Grab some other color. All right, now I'm gonna come in here, grab some more sap green. And we're just gonna come in here. Add some bushes. Change up the colors. Just a little bit of your feet falling in the dark. And we got ourselves some thick trees right here. Pretty much grow wherever. Alrighty. Well. That is a very, very horrible painting, and I can't believe I'm getting ready to upload this on YouTube. But if you stuck around, thanks. Maybe we'll have a little bit more fun next time.